This little short is all about carbon fiber. Carbon fiber is amazing. It just doesn't burn. Plumbers, HVAC people use this when they've got a weld in a tight spot. It's fiber, but it's made of carbon. Now what's cool about carbon fiber is that you can take it, you can put it through a little, cut your little piece off like that, roll it up in a tube, stick it through a copper pipe, stick it in a tube or a glass of regular old vegetable oil. And you have, in essence, a candle that will last forever and a wick that will never burn down. Well, will it ever burn down? Maybe eventually. But this thing will burn for years and years. And this piece of carbon fiber will outlast my lifetime. I'll never use all of this carbon fiber. I'll turn friends onto this and I'll give them pieces of this to show them how to make this little candle out of corn oil. Now what's really cool about this is you can cook on it with your camp stove. That's fine. But what's amazing is during the winter time, you can make yourself a hot tent heater. And by doing that, you take a little Dollar Tree, $1 steel bowl. You take a Goodwill aluminum strainer from Ikea or Walmart. And if you put that over that, and you put that bowl on top of that, that will heat up to over 580 degrees. That will heat a 20 square foot radius tarp tent or shelter. You can go ahead and pan out there, see that tarp tent and that shelter. That will heat that during the winter time from 30 degrees outside to about, okay, bring it back here, from 30 degrees Fahrenheit outside, the inside of your tent will be a toasty 50, 55, maybe even 60 degrees. As a matter of fact, in the time that we've been speaking, that is, you can barely, you can barely touch that. That will radiate heat. And that corn oil will burn in that glass. Just that little bit of corn oil right there will burn for about six hours so it's a cheap form of heating your tent it's a cheap form of cooking and it's carbon fiber you can get it on amazon you get it on uh, internet uh, it's just an amazing little hack that you can do camping you can heat your tent cook on it and give you also a source of light at night so that's about it and then when you're done all you got to do close it up It goes out, and you're good to go for the next time.